there is no day four. Yes, there's no day four because I didn't get an opportunity to record yesterday. But I will tell you what I ended up eating for dinner was the leftovers, which was salmon and rice, the, the um, whole grain rice. I didn't have, eat any peas or anything like that. Earlier yesterday, um, I didn't, I fast. I fast for the most of the day. I did have coffee. When I got home, I was tired. So I just ate dinner and I went to sleep. Um, however, I got a little got a little grouchy so I'm gonna tell you what I did I got up and made myself a spinach omelet I probably shouldn't have had the, the sharp cheddar cheese up there but I did so just wanted to let you know what I did yesterday I didn't get an opportunity to record today I have only had coffee and now it's lunchtime I had some oatmeal from McDonald's they didn't put my fruit in there. Normally they have apples and raisins and stuff on top, but I just did the plain oatmeal and I did have a hash brown. So, probably won't have anything for dinner um, until I, well, I can't really tell you what I'm gonna have for dinner until I actually get home tonight. I didn't make any preparation or I didn't plan or anything like that. So, I'll let you guys know. Oh, and also, I have I did not eat cabbage soup yesterday. I'm not eating it today. I have this thing about um, eating cabbage, what, two or three days, well, three days after I've cooked it. So, I have to make a fresh batch of that cabbage soup. But I didn't, I had um, not a whole lot left but enough that where I was like, you know what, I'm not eating this because I didn't know how it would affect me. Um, I just don't do three day old cabbage. <laughs> okay, so I wanted to let you guys know that too. Okay guys, so I'm home now. <laughs> so um, I had the oatmeal today, now for a snack before I eat dinner because I do not know what I'm going to eat. As I stated to you guys earlier, I'm gonna have some life cereal. So I'm just gonna have a bowl of life. Um, and I'll come back and I'll let you guys know, you know, from there what I plan to do or what I plan to eat for the evening. All right, thanks for watching. Oh uh, guys, I um as I'm sitting here eating my live cereal, um I want to show you guys the wheat thins that I was eating yesterday. I told you guys I was eating on some crackers. Sorry. But these are the wheat thins that I I didn't finish the entire bag, but it's wheat thins and it was the veggie the veggie flavor. They're 100% whole grain wheat, and they were actually good. So, this on my hair. Um, they were actually good. So, I just wanted to show you guys the wheat thins that I ate yesterday. I got them out of our vending machine at work. Okay, guys. So, this is what um, I'm eating tonight. Some rotisserie chicken. Um, I got some potato skins i just got one and it was about what eight in the thingamajig that i got from wegmans and i got some crab balls the crab balls were baked and i got my um my rotisserie chicken and it's lemon peppered so you know i got some protein and some carbohydrates in um, you know, you want to make sure you get everything in um, the cheese and the cheese sauce and the little bit of bacon. You know, I could spare that because I haven't been eating, you know, inappropriately um, throughout the week. So I just wanted to let you know, um, this is what I ended up eating. And again, um, if I get hungry, I will have me a bowl of life and guess what i stepped on a scale today and i lost three pounds can you believe it so all together i've lost four pounds just by changing what i eat within one week i haven't had any sodas i've been drinking water 
Um, I did the cabbage soup. Um, I had at least maybe about five bowls all together. Um, and that's basically it, you know, not eating junk food and things like that. So um, I've lost all together four pounds and we're gonna see where I'm at by Sunday. So just wanted to let you guys know.